good morning out here with Heath. We kayaked out and uh, set a little mixed spread, I guess. We got about two dozen goose floaters. There's a little ice shelf out in front where there's goose crap, so we put a couple on the ice. Might tweak the spread as the morning progresses. The wind's supposed to be kind of over my right shoulder here right now. It's more of a crosswind, but not that big a deal. And then we put a few diver decoys out here and a couple mallards in with the geese. So could shoot some ducks, could shoot some geese, could get skunked like we did yesterday. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. Those are mergs. A few mergs. Just a few. There's your commons. Nope. Here's a look at the spread. Just got goose decoys, a pair of mallards mixed in. And there's some goose crap out here on this ice, so we put some floaters on the ice. And then uh, just a little diver raft out here. We decoyed some mergs to them already, so that's about it. Heard a few geese, haven't seen any fly since shooting time. We're just out here exploring this ice shelf and you can see where there was geese actually just they were just sitting here and it melted into the ice and then we got some duck tracks a bunch of crap all on the ice and the duck tracks just go all the way across here but haven't seen much for the ducks or the geese really that's a good sign though that they're <laughs> they were using it so hopefully they'll be back You want me to shoot him, Heath? <laughs> we'll take a snow. Well, we're just about to head out to move some decoys because the wind is nowhere close to the direction or the speed they said it was actually supposed to be calm right now which glad they're wrong on that but it's also supposed to be right at our back and it's almost kind of a crosswind in our face a little bit but <laughs> we had a juvie fly over and he banked in so we're on the board with a juvenile snow goose we'll make him into a sleeper on the ice he won't hurt anything and that's first snow of the year and uh, first bird with the 12 gauge this year too so good to know the 12 gauge still works Got him. There. The he do, he, dude, he just whoosh. <laughs> Sorry. No, you're good. I hit him the first shot, I had to finish him, but. <laughs> Oh, little guy. Awesome. <laughs> Short neck, I love it. More mergs. We got a sleeper. Yeah, right there, boom. All right, that, that thing just, that goose just dumped in. Like I just saw him swoop around and dump in. That was crazy. Above our head. Yeah, I, I literally heard his wing. I heard his wing beat. I look up and it's just like, whoosh, whoosh, and then he's like, he well he turned. He was trying to land, I think on the ice, yeah. or maybe hook back around. But uh, he was he was right above the ice when you first shot. He was either gonna land on the ice or just past the ice. All right, Heath. Next single's yours. I just didn't want him getting away, so this one's you, Heath. Where's he at? Yeah. 
Yeah, right there. Yeah. Might just have to shoot it over top here, Heath. Right there. Shoot him. Shoot him. There. You hit him that first shot. He actually is a juvie blue. Yeah, juvie blue. I thought he was. Cool. Yeah. Let's see that guy. Yeah. Juvie blue. No bands. No bands. Another sleeper. We're just picking off single snow geese. I'm not gonna complain though, that's cool. Single snows and single... Single cans, yeah. Yeah, we keep having to adjust decoys because the wind keeps kind of shifting on us, but we'll make it work. Well, we are making it work, I guess. We got three down, so good start to the morning. I'm just throwing a few more on ice. Cannonball it here. All right, we finally have the wind from the direction and speed they said. So now <laughs> we finally have a decoy spread that uh, we we're originally set up for. Tweaked a little bit and try to decoy them on the ice. Huh? So oh, cool. Just had a solo, actually I had a flock come over, called a solo out of it. He came right behind us. Heath missed and I cleaned him up, so I've got a snow goose now and two cans. A little bigger honker, I think. Not much. Yeah. That'll work. Slowly, slowly picking away at him. Been a couple hours since we even had one decoy, so. Oh yeah, he's cupped up. Just let him in here. Shoot him over top here, he's... Well, wait. He's coming in. Shoot him. <laughs> I called it, I didn't... He was too far out for me. There we are. Bigger honker. I was gonna let Heath shoot him, but... He came in on more on my side. You want to come over on this side a little more? Yeah, I, was kind of that. I don't know. Don't know if they're gonna. There. That's definitely the biggest honker of the day. I'm at three honkers in the snow. Heat's at a blue goose. Man, he worked in nice, and we we're gonna shoot him back behind, and then he just kept coming. Well, I kept waiting for you to shoot him, but. He swung out strong. I probably should have or could have, but... I mean, it just let him get in tighter. I'm fine with that. And we are calling that a day. It's been pretty slow. Well, honestly, most of the day. There was some flocks flying high throughout the morning, 
and we just had a few singles work in here and there. We had, we were fighting the wind. It was variable, and then it went calm, and then it finally whipped up. Now we have a really good wind. Unfortunately, can't stay out all day. Heath has to get home, so that's how that goes. But still a good day. We decoyed five geese in, and we shot five geese. I got three cans and a juvie snow, and then Heath got the juvie blues. But we'll get back after it. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Be sure to go there to support those conservation organizations, Ducks Unlimited, Delta Waterfowl, and we'll catch you out there. See ya.